New developments, a group of ham radio operators are volunteering their time to help those affected by Hurricane Maria in Puerto Rico. Yeah, the group of volunteers arrived on the island today with equipment to help reestablish communication. Channel 5's Tracen Bragg spoke with the local director of the National Association of Amateur Radio to learn how these volunteers will be helping those in need. The expert we spoke to tells us amateur radio is the form of communication that can be counted on when all other lines of communication fail. And I guess the final question Dr. David Wool Weaver is the director of the West Gulf Division of the National Association for Amateur Radio. He says Hurricane Maria has left parts of Puerto Rico with no power, gas, or communication services. So his association teamed up with the Red Cross and sent 50 volunteers armed with radios to the island. So we're sending systems down, repeater systems they're called, and that will be designed to assist the police, the fire, and emergency services so they can get back to providing the, the support for the people. He tells us that first wave of volunteers are dedicated to providing rescuers the communication services they need. He says the second group of volunteers are being assembled. The second wave, we hope, will be taking with them high-speed systems that will be able to transmit information back to the United States to support what we call health and welfare traffic. That's information that about the individuals that are living there so we can be certain their loved ones are, are safe and sound. Dr. Will Weaver explains the high-speed systems will have the capability to reach the entire United States. He tells us a number of the volunteers sent to Puerto Rico will also make their way to the U.S. Virgin Islands to help reestablish their lines of communication as well. Dr. Wool Reaver says his association will continue to further their education and update their equipment to ensure they are ready to assist those in need. In the studio, Trace and Bragg, Channel 5 News at 1030.